Uh, I'm back. Just, uh, let me know if everything sounds okay. I was having a little bit of audio trouble when I just did the switch. Oh, one sec. Uh, I gotta plug in the computer. Sorry, just some quick technical things I forgot to, uh, one moment. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Good call. You can update the name of the stream to whatever you want to. I'll let you have full power with that, which is, uh, fun. Uh, there's... Sorry, just forgot to plug something in. It's quality content, I guess. There we go. Hopefully the stream didn't drop. Okay, there we go. Hopefully you can hear everything. I unfortunately cannot hear anything at the moment. <laughs> Nicely done. <laughs> I like that. Okay, so we're all good. Everything seems to be going good. Hopefully, you can hear everything okay. Uh, so, yeah, we're gonna have a zoo in the front, which is gonna be like, I guess, a zoo. Basic grass map, $500,000 starting cash. Let's go. Uh, let me know if you can hear everything okay. Unfortunately, I can't hear the game, but uh, I think that's just a sound thing I've, I messed up when I did the switch. Uh, so, anyways, and of course, you hold down Shift 4. In Zoo Tycoon, it gives you instant uh, $10,000, but does start to decay your fences, so the idea is that you do that at the beginning. Uh, so we'll start with a cool 4.1 million. Um, I think Bandit Bot's still running. Uh, actually, I may have accidentally closed that. One moment, I will be right back. Okay, um, so it's just starting up now. I accidentally cl closed the, uh, the bot. So anyways, it should be... Okay, it should be good now. And uh, the regular bot should be up and running as well. But uh, yeah, let's get started. So, <laughs> not sure if she upvote or downvote you. Uh oh. <laughs> let's start with uh, a dinosaur. No bacon for you. Yep. Sorry, bandit. I'm uh, going to start with a little dinosaur fence. This is what's going to get people into our zoo, which is going to fund Animal Fight Club. Uh, need scientist and uh, the DRT. We gotta at least make it look like we care about our patrons at the beginning, uh, but they will get fired at the end, I guess. No, it's empty, so I click it. That's fine. Let's see here. Allosaurus. Bup. You. You get assigned to this cage. Okay, nice. Anyways, well, all these, uh, oh, I don't have my cheat sheet on me, but I think if you dino man, dino, I think that unlocks all the dinos. Yes, it does. Okay, yeah. That's one of the cheat codes. So I wanted to get all the dinosaurs. Um, They'll eventually hatch, but in the meantime, we can go all the way out over here, and this is where the fun's gonna happen. So we're gonna make our uh, let's call this Fight Club. All right. So what do you guys want to see first? Well, let's see. Ha. Huh. Let's try. Oh, good. We'll have to deal with their complaints in a moment. But uh, we'll put the key here for now. Split this one in half. Zookeeper. These no, you know, can't do that. Okay, fine. Let's put. Let's start with some tigers. Um, two tigers versus two lions. And then let's get the zookeeper on both of those two exhibits. And probably going to have problems with animals being unhappy. Oh, <laughs> he must be the very smart one. Okay. So let's make these people happy. Actually, let's first get this started so you guys can place your bets. So we have Mount Bengal Tigers or Team 1. Uh, Mount Lions or Team 2. Oh, it'd be just start. Uh, so you just do bet the amount. And then the bet you want, to, the team you want to bet on. So you just do like um, for bet five points on team. Or it's fine. Sorry, bet five points on team two. To put five points on team two. Uh, and you can also do bal to see your balance. And yeah. So in the meantime, I will try not to get shut down. So yeah, place your bets. Uh, I think everybody starts with one thousand. So enjoy. And I'll give you a moment to. You can bet on both teams if you want. It doesn't matter. There you go. happy okay too much not enough rain wash fresh water not enough grass okay we can do that what do you take to bet um exclamation point bet uh the number of points you want to bet and then the team you want to bet on um and that'll do the trick for you okay more rocks you guys don't seem to like my zoo room oh no not enough grass Actually, you know what? Let's just sell all our animals and then just... Oh, going all in. Wow. 
Because yeah, you only have 1,000 points, but I can give you more points if uh, you start to run out. Anyways, I have an idea. Let's just sell all of our animals. That way we can just focus on Fight Club, and then we don't have to worry about the zoo part of the zoo. And then if people don't like it, then that's too bad for them. We fire these people. Ah, oh, there we go. <laughs> You're going big, okay. I'll give everybody points after this round. Hopefully they actually fight, because that does happen sometimes. I don't actually have a refund command, so <laughs> things get might get dicey. Anyways. Let us begin. Go! Oh, I should probably also stop the uh, deading here. You. Go fight each other for our entertainment. Okay, so they don't seem to be fighting. That does suck. Alright, I can say that I was not expecting that to happen. This is disappointing. Can't throw any more. Well, he might not be happy, but at least he's full. Alright, so they don't seem to be fighting. So instead of what I'll do is... uh. <clears throat> Dinkelberg is the only person who bet on Team 1, and uh, Melch and Avari, you guys voted on Team 2. So why not you guys uh, just say what you want on your team, and then we'll have a battle royale. Because I think if you sell all your animals, then it'll just let you, like, adopt more? No. Okay, there we go. Rhinos? Okay. So rhinos are going on Team 1. And I will pause the game when I do this, so that we can have uh, a lot of time. <laughs> Dinkelberg going for the T-Rex. Alright, we can do that. I will put up an electric fence for that. There we go. Get rid of that one right there. All right. Um, we'll also get rid of this little fence here. Don't want them breaking through before it's time. You know what I mean? So T-Rexes, we'll put in... We'll put three T-Rexes in, I guess. One, two, three. Uh, rhinos, you said. All right, let's get those in. Okay, it doesn't look like we have any rhinos just yet. Oh, yes, we do. We'll put in three of these guys. And crocodiles. Ah, crocodile. One, two, three. All right, anybody else want anything else? <laughs> Last call before we uh, get those T-Rexes all hatched and we begin the fight. Although it's possible the <laughs> alligators and the rhinos may attack each other. Okay, we'll do this. There. And then we'll delete this fence, but then hopefully these two don't fight each other. <laughs> that could be bad. Actually, let's make things more fun. Let's put more crocodiles and rhinos in, because I think the T-Rexes will be just fine on their own. All right, six of these, four of five, there we go. All right, well, let's get started. So these people are team one. These people are team two. We will hire you and you'll be assigned to this enclosure and go. And just watch our happiness rating go down the toilet. In the meantime, I'm gonna go sell all this stuff over here because it costs money. There, sure. <laughs> Guests can uh, come and view our little pond and our pile of rotting meat. Just what you wanna see at every zoo. All right. Will the crocodile T-Rex or Rhino win the fight? You think the Rhino will win? Oh, okay. Well, you know what? I'll put uh, I'll put 10 points in as Bandit then. 10 points on Team 1. There. Oh, whoops. My bad. <laughs> this is Rhino sniffing this guy's butt. That's funny. All right, eggs. We're all waiting on you. But uh, let's see. Let's... No, no. No, no. No. Okay. Okay, there we go. Uh, dinosaur. Sure. No. I'm just trying to get us what, uh, what will give us the most amount of animals. Ah, there we go, finally. I guess nothing's been... Aha, look at that. Just waiting on our third friend. I will also research orca and shark drink. Okay, number three, you got this. All waiting on you. And then you can... Oh, there we go. Oh, <laughs> look at all that poo. All right, here we go. Go! You gonna do anything there? Oh, oh that's a fast rhino. There. You go there. And you can go there. Oh, narwhal's available. That's good. Well, at least these people seem to be having a good time. Oh good, yeah, okay, they're chasing each other, that's good to see. <laughs> oh, fine. National Organization of Z. It's almost like this game wasn't meant to have battle royales. <laughs> oh no, they're going for the rhinos! Oh no! They're on your team! Ah, <laughs> oh, they've all cornered themselves except for this guy right here. He's pretty smart. Oh, I guess that just means we'll have to make the uh, area smaller. <laughs> Let's use this fence, okay. Yeah, we'll, we'll gradually make the uh, play area smaller so that they're forced to interact with these nice dinosaur fences. Nope, oh, I think they can actually just step over these fences. I don't think it really matters. Okay, electrified fence here, and then we'll just put everybody in a smaller area. Ah, there we go. First crocodile's down. None of our animals are happy. Come with me, put up an electrical fence here. <laughs> I think it was a good idea going for the uh, T-Rexes there, Dingleberg. Oh, they're hiding behind the dinosaur poo. There was another Rhino back here, but I could be wrong. Anyway, that's probably fine. Oh. <laughs> oh no. 
<laughs> They're all trying to eat each other. This this guy's just kind of like, I, I don't care. Leave me alone. <laughs> the best place to hide is behind dinosaur poo. You can certainly say that again. <laughs> Off. This area more and more. I think we got everybody. Just gotta double check. Oh, I knew we missed a rhino. Uh oh. Think you might have just won this one, Dinkelberg. <laughs> yeah, they got a rhino and a crocodile left. Oh, uh oh, just a crocodile, but it looks like they're having trouble getting to it. So I think he's actually safe in that little corner there. All right, let's give him a little hand, I guess. There. All right, <laughs> looks like, uh... yeah, it looks like Team 1 got this, so Team 1. No, that's not the command. Shoot, I forgot what the command is. Uh, one sec, I gotta look this up. I gotta go through my source code real quick and uh, figure out what I called that command because I balance. Oh, winner, of course. Obviously. W1. Wow, nice. Congratulations, Dinkelberg. So let's clean up all this area out here. Hey, look at that. And we don't need you anymore. We probably don't even have any guests in our. <laughs> Alright, there we go. So let's see how many guests are in the zoo. Oh, people are still coming to our zoo. That's funny. <laughs> I'd be so cheesed if I uh, paid $22 for a zoo ticket and then just saw this and some still rotting meat. All right, let's try a water battle this time. Uh, just throw out some animal names in the chat and then uh, or some aquatic life and we can have a little fun with that. Orca? Okay, sounds good. Oops, bring a big tank here. Oh, hello, welcome, Kel. <laughs> Welcome! So right now we're doing uh, Animal Fight Club in Zoo Tycoon. Uh, yeah, we have narwhals available, so I think we just unlocked those. So anyway, we'll get uh, all that going. <laughs> uh, pause the game. Okay, so we have some narwhals. We'll put uh, two narwhals over here. I'll put three, because why not? Um, orcas, you said. There we are. Orcas, we'll put them in this corner. Three orcas. Uh, any other suggestions? We have things like lion's mane jelly. Uh, sawfish, great white, barracuda, tiger sharks, hammerhead shark. Oh, that's weird. Oh, I got the notification that you followed. Thank you for the follow, by the way. Uh, yeah, I just got the notification now and, and two days ago that you did as well. That's that's weird. But thank you for the follow. <laughs> Appreciate it. Hey, it's not too late to jump ship and do a great white. That's no big deal. Two, three. There's three great white sharks for you. Yeah, that is weird. But thank you for the follow, anyways. Oh, okay. That's really weird. Anyways, it's no big deal. Uh... <laughs> Very weird, yeah, yeah. Now let's put some hammerheads in for fun. There we go. <laughs> Alright, so we got some orcas, great white sharks, narwhals, and hammerheads. So let's see. Four teams. Uh, betting is now open. I gotta add, like, elephant seals. <laughs> Thanks, Bandit Bot. Thank you. Uh, always always being very insightful. Are there elephant seals? Let's stop, actually. I'm gonna stop that. Uh, let's have a look. Oh, we do have elephant seals. Yeah, let's put that in as well. One, two, three. There we go. So we have five teams here. Uh, I'm going to forget which one's which, by the way, so they'll have to remind me. Oh, whoops, sorry. Okay, so I guess team one will be the orcas. I should write this down. Um, actually, I'll put this in the chat. One sure thing. Orca seal three is going to be narwhal, four is hammerhead, and five is great white. There we go. So just to bet, you just do uh, exclamation point bet. Um, you pick an amount to amount of points to bet on, so I'll go, so go 10, and then a team, I'll just go 2, I guess. Uh, everybody has a thousand points off the board. You can just do exclamation point bell to check your balance. Uh, and yeah, enjoy. Uh, if you start to run low on points, I can just throw out points willy-nilly. It's, uh, it's nothing to do with like channel points or anything like that. Oh, and you don't need the word team either, just do the number. But uh, yeah, yeah, there you go. 100 points on team 1, nice. Dinkelberg won the last round when we put, uh, what was it? Yeah, nice, there you go. 500 on team one, wow. Nice. <laughs> Dinkelberg went it all in on a bunch of uh, T-Rexes last round. And feel free to bet on as many teams as you like. You know, there's no limit. <laughs> 750 points on team two, wow. Okay, everybody starts off with 1,000, but uh, sure thing, yeah. And you can just do exclamation point bell to check your balance. Points are the limit, yeah. But if you run out, I can just give you more points, so <laughs> no limit there. And uh, there's no guarantee these things are actually going to fight each other. So in that case, we'll uh, I have rock, paper, scissors or something. All right. Let's see. How long so far? All right. <laughs> Is everybody uh, good to go? <laughs> yeah. Everybody just gets along. Then we're all going to be disappointed. Oh, and this is our zoo, by the way. Uh, guests can come in and observe this pile of rotting meat and uh, Animal Fight Club. 
having an underwater tea party. Exactly. That's exactly what they're doing. All right, looks like uh, Bandit's ready to go. And uh, just as a reminder, you can just at Bandit the bot and ask it any question you'd like, and uh, it will reply with, uh, it'll, it'll make a response and, and reply to your message. So enjoy that. But uh, if Bandit's ready to go, then I will close bidding. And here we go. So it looks like we will win. The winner will be the one who gets the most votes. As per usual, Bandit, <laughs> spot on responses. <laughs> That's true. That's true. Uh oh. Looks like the orca just ate somebody. Oh no, it's killing all the narwhals. Let's see here. Oh no, all the narwhals have been eliminated. One ha hammerhead shark left. Four narwhals. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, let's get some uh, Fs in the chat for the narwhals, I guess. <laughs> oh. Oh, that's a whale shark, not a great white shark. I messed that one up. <laughs> that one's on me. Okay, let's put some great white sharks instead of whale sharks in. I think they look kind of big. <laughs> yeah, that's kind of a... Oh, that poor hammerhead. Swim, buddy, swim. Ow. Maybe you don't have great white sharks yet. Huh. Looks like we don't. That is unfortunate. I botched that one up. Anyways. Maybe like we have some patrons coming. That's good. Okay. <laughs> the elephant seal is smart. He's staying away from the orcas. And the whale sharks appear to be just kind of doing their own thing. Did anybody bet on the whale sharks? No, they did. <laughs> whale shark three is not happy. Let's see. What are you? What are you not happy about? Foliage, rocks, incompatible animals. That sucks. Yeah, it doesn't look like the uh, orcas are going to be fighting the whale sharks. Let's put them right next to each other and see what happens. Nope. They just kind of swim right through each other. Okay, that's cool. <laughs> Let's see what happens. We put the ele elephant seal right in front of the orca. Oh. You know, I can't help but feel a little bit responsible for that one. All right, so we have Team 1 Orcas, Team 5 Great White Sharks, 600 versus 500 points, and neither of them are fighting each other. Let's see more animals available. What we got? Dolphin, jelly... Don't think we got the Great White, though. All right, so we're going to have to settle this somehow. Uh, does anybody have any ideas? Actually, better yet. We'll see what we did in the last round, then. Um, whale Shark versus Orca. So whoever teamed on bet on Team 1, uh, we'll pick... What goes on one team and the person who picked on people who picked uh team five will decide who goes in the second team and then of like a, of a new battle and hopefully we'll have more success so i forget who bet on what so yeah, if, if you bet on team one let me know what you want on team one if you bet on team five let me know about that one and then we'll do kind of like a grand finale orcas okay sounds good you bet oh you bet on the orcas okay sounds good uh so yeah let me know what you want on your new team and we'll uh, get that assembled and we can do some uh, dinosaurs too. We can put a Loch Ness monster, I guess, in here. Marks of all. Orcas again? All right, sounds good. So orcas. Oh yeah, yeah, we have dinosaurs. Yeah. Well, let's see here. We have uh, T-Rex, a couple of Velociraptors, I think. Yeah, Velociraptors, Allosaurus, Stegosaurus. What kind of zoo is this? Uh, this is a very crazy zoo. Oh yeah, we have Loch Ness monsters. There's a way to unlock. Uh, I forget what you have to name. If you name a an enclosure a certain name you can actually unlock unicorns <laughs> which is pretty cool yeah the last zoo to have dinosaurs was a bit of a problem yeah yeah i think it was like crustaceous park or something like that something along those lines <laughs> anyways so who bet on team five i think you did avari are you with the dino yeah i don't think they can quite swim oh i didn't know that huh that's good to know I guess it's a good thing. That would probably really suck if you had to throw up as a giraffe if you had that long of a neck. Neither can horses. Oh, well, that's really interesting. Rabbits too? Oh, okay. Yeah. Or most rodents. Oh, okay. Well, I guess it makes sense why, yeah, like you said, poison's so effective. Yeah. Huh. Yeah, the more you know. <laughs> oh, uh, speaking of, uh, I guess, animal vomit facts. <laughs> oh, you don't hear your options? Okay, I'll, I'll just scroll through the list and uh, it'll show you what we have. Uh, but if, if you got vomited on by a bronchiosaurus and you were standing on like a reasonably hard surface, you'd actually get crushed to death by the vomit falling from them. <laughs> yeah, speaking of animal vomit facts, uh, the only place you get vomit facts is uh, here on my channel where we talk about vomit facts. <laughs> oh, okay. Too small for you to see on your phone screen. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. Uh, so I guess if we're going with marine life, then we have the uh, short fin manco shark, hammerhead... Uh, tiger shark, well, we have whale shark, which doesn't really work. Barracuda, sawfish, um, bowhead whale, giant Pacific octopus, uh, swordfish, uh, oh, lion's mane jelly. That could be kind of fun. Anyways, those are the marine-based options. So if any of those are jumping out at you, let me know. I can uh, 
put those in in place of the whale sharks to figure out who our winner is. Oh, octopus? Okay, sounds good. So we'll put in three of these. One, two, three. Either jelly or octopus. Oh, okay. Uh, it's up to you. We can do half and half, but there's the risk that we'll fight each other. But yeah, I'm pretty sure, in, even in nature, uh, orcas and squid, giant squid, fight each other. Like, the orcas will try and eat them, and the, the squid will try and drown them. But anyways, octopus is good. Probably won't go anywhere, that's true. Let's just elevate this. And go! Orca 3 can't find any food? Well, I need to break it to you, but it's right here. Right here, right here. Ah, they do fight, that's good news. Oh, and the orcas are... <laughs> Having a very nice lunch. <laughs> Orca one looks overjoyed. <laughs> That's funny. Uh oh, last octopus. <laughs> I think you might be right. So you were team one, right? Orcas were team one. Yeah. Orcas were. Te yep, team one. Okay, yeah. Orcas are a natural predator of moose. <laughs> yeah. I think I'm pretty sure orcas are like an apex predator. So yeah, team one. Okay, yeah, good. <laughs> and orcas are a natural predator of moose. Well, let's see. Let's see if we can get an orca to fight a moose. Oh, never mind, we just got shut down. <laughs> Whoops. Apparently the National Organization of Zoos doesn't really appreciate it when you get animals to fight for amusement. But yeah, let's try and put a, a orc and a moose against each other. Uh, but yeah, congratulations, uh, Kel. <laughs> you got this. Who would win, orca or a moose? A moose is too big. Okay, congratulations. Oh, come on. <laughs> just got the great white. Oh yeah, you got lots of points there. Very good. Alright, we'll uh, sell these... You nearly doubled your points. Yeah, that's pretty awesome. Hey, look at that. All you have to do is sell your animals and that makes them all happy. Okay, so we're going to have to try and figure out how to put an orca and a moose against each other. I think I might know how. See, I think you can combine enclosures, like the uh, water ones and uh, the land-based ones, and this, so that this is flush. And then if you surround this one... Oh, it looks like we're getting some people in the enclosure too. That's okay. Yeah, okay, yeah, there we go. They can climb onto the land and stuff like that. I'm gonna pause the game real quick. So we have enough time to get everybody out. Orcas, three orcas, and he said a moose. I'm not gonna start a pool because I don't even know if this is gonna work. If we can get them on the same area. Or even if we have meat, moose, moose. Yeah, moose is the plural of moose, right? I think so. We have a reindeer. Might be as close as we can get at the moment. Bongo. Okay, we have a moose. Okay. We'll do five moose. No, it's moose, right? Yeah, the plural of moose is. Let's see what happens. And they'll fight each other? No. No, it doesn't look like they go for each other, sadly. That's too bad. Alright. Wanna do a dinosaur battle then? In that case? I'll just get all this uh, cleaned up. Because unfortunately they're not gonna go for it. <laughs> yeah. I tried to put the moose in the water directly and it wouldn't let me. So I don't think it's like allowed to go in the... the um, I don't think it's like... Yeah, like you said, it's not coded there to be able to go in the water. It's almost like the game doesn't want us to do an animal fight club. But anyways... I'm going to try and keep this enclosure here because we actually have some patrons in the enclosure, so I think it'd be funny to have them get eaten. <laughs> Alright, let's quickly switch this to an electric fence. <laughs> there we go. Um, it's a people zoo, exactly! You can come to the zoo and see people. Let's uh, let's do two teams this time. Uh, and go ahead and let me know what you want on each team. Um, we have things like uh, people and kangaroos. That we can, actually. Yeah, let's do it. If we have kangaroos unlocked, that is. Which I think we do. I do not think we have kangaroos, unfortunately. Yeah, that's disappointing. No kangaroos, but we do have African lions, so... <laughs> the people don't appreciate that very much. Oh, sounds good. Uh, thank you for stopping by. I'll probably be ending soon anyway. But yeah, I hope you had fun. Uh, yeah, thank you for stopping by. Oh, that's a good point. I forgot about that. Yeah, they kind of do all the work, yeah, don't they? There we go. We'll just put a few in. Just a small amount. Oh, okay, game starting to struggle. Yeah, they don't really uh, understand the concept of not getting eaten. Although it seems to be working, so is, uh, <laughs> this person is just casually walking. That's uh, that's funny. Haha, -ha. nice try. I don't know, let's put a couple T-Rexes in the other enclosure and have them go at it. A bunch of lions versus a couple of T-Rexes. Although unfortunately, I don't think the animals like team up. I think it's uh, kind of a free for all. So, anyways, there and then. Oh, game's a struggle. Perfect. This one, and uh, actually we'll put like 10 in. That was more than 10, but that's okay. And fortunately the gates can open for the people, but not the animals, so <laughs> they can get out. But uh, I guess after yeah, the Grand Finale, we'll put a bunch of uh, T-Rexes versus a bunch of lions. Uh, and then we'll probably call it here. So, 
We'll say lions are team one and T Rexes are team two. And uh, let's see here. But oh, unfortunately, uh, you can't use all. But you can uh, you can say balance to figure out what your balance is. All right, <laughs> going all in. Okay, sounds good. Everybody's going in all in on team two for the T Rexes. Okay, you know what? Just for fun, just so there is. Uh, I'll go all in on team one then. There. And uh, of course, let's consult the uh, ever all knowing bandit. Wood. There. Lions. Okay. Just waiting for some of these eggs to hatch. Let's disable this so it calms down a little bit. Oh. <laughs> could you end up fighting with a T Rex? He thinks he could, but he doesn't have a T Rex. Okay. I guess uh, Bandit realizes that he'll probably never see a T Rex, so it can claim to, to win. <laughs> That's kind of funny. There we go. Now we're getting their little T Rexes. Actually, let's, uh, just for fun. Oh, never mind. I was going to put in two, a couple of female Velociraptors so we'd be like, clever girl. <laughs> just like uh, Jurassic Park, but uh, I, I can't adopt animals because apparently having like 50 lions in one, one enclosure is not ethical. <laughs> nope, guests are crowding to see this spectacle though. Gee, guest 243, why don't you take a closer look? <laughs> panicking and this bunch of scientists being like, eh, just a normal day in the office. Keep up the good work, guest 243. There we go. There we go. I think we're just waiting on three more. Any day now. Yeah, we could probably start it now. Let's see here. All right, this is gonna be a nice payout for uh, you both if you if you guys win. Yeah, let's go for it. They'll hatch when they hatch. It probably won't be very instant anyway. All right. Ooh. Yeah, I think you guys you guys were right to pick the T Rexes. <laughs> and of course, we'll make the uh, enclosure smaller and smaller as time goes on just because I want to make sure that you know things get moving a little bit they don't just keep running away from each other coward Oops. friends in there that's fine uh oh another one down <laughs> everybody's happy about the smaller cage which is interesting gonna head out sounds good yeah I'll be uh, heading out in a minute too but uh, thanks for stopping by oh somebody's getting all defensive <laughs> thanks for stopping by I uh, hope you enjoyed Block this engine off. Oh. Block this off, and then we can move into here. And then if, ever, any, if anybody gets like lost in the cracks, they'll just be released at the end. Hey, more animals and objects. Probably got a kangaroo now that uh, final battle. <laughs> uh oh, looks like they busted through. Probably should start using electrical fences. That's ah, okay. It's fine. <laughs> Destroys the fence. That's funny. Might have been easier just to kind of start them in a smaller enclosure. Thinking about it, I guess next time we do this, it might be easier just to use Ultimate Epic Battle Simulator, which is designed for these crazy battles. But uh, that's alright. Nice. Yeah, three lions left. Two lions. Uh oh, only one left. Oh, and it got caught over here. There you go. So it looks like uh, the winner was team two. Actually, one second, double check. Oh yeah, team two. <laughs> nice. And last but not least, I'm gonna destroy all this, all these cages, and uh, that usually crashes the game when you all the uh, T-Rexes go after people. Oh, are they going after the scientists? That's hilarious. <laughs> oh, congratulations. <laughs> That's funny though. Like uh, they all live in harmony. The moment the fence breaks, it's like okay, it's time to eat them. Eat some scientists. But yeah, anyway, uh, thanks for coming out. Hope you enjoyed. Uh, if you have any suggestions of what I should do next time, or uh, anything like that, you know, you can always let me know. Uh, <laughs> Lunatic Zoo. <laughs> Welcome, yes. Uh, just about to sign off for the night. But yeah, we, uh, as you can tell by the T-Rexes that are just kind of hanging out, and the people who do not care, <laughs> it's been a good stream. <laughs> uh, that's right. But anyways... Uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you have any suggestions for what I do next time, let me know. But uh, otherwise, thanks for coming out. I hope you had a fun. And I don't have an outro still, so I'm just going to kind of awkwardly end it. And yes, there's a giant poo everywhere. You as well. Thank you.